Right then, Tower Block Archive, and today we've got the Ledbury Estate in Southwark. This estate has the large panel system architecture, England's most hated architecture. Now, I actually think this architecture looks really good. I think it looks stunning. I just really like the look of it. And in this video, we're going to take a look in one of the flats. And the flats actually are quite spacious and actually pretty nice. But even though I like this architecture, most people hate it. Most people think it looks horrid. But most of all, there are loads of fears over the structural integrity of the estate. Now, the panels themselves, because the estate's made up of loads of panels stacked on each other, the panels themselves are really well built. They're heavy duty and very solid. But the problem is what holds the panels together. The panels are supposed to have protruding ray bar where the different panels are stacked up on each other then concrete is meant to infill where the ray bar is. But a lot of these panels were manufactured with the ray bar missing. Meaning that even if the concrete was infilled it wouldn't be strong enough. But on a lot of these estates, there wasn't any concrete infield. For example, when I watched Morris Walker Estate being demolished, now I loved Morris Walker Estate, it looked epic. But when I watched it being demolished, there was nothing holding the panels together. The panels were literally just stacked up and piled up to make the estate incredibly dangerous. Now, with the Ledbury Estate in this video, Southwark are talking about doing lots of repair works, adding an internal structure to support the estate and make it safe. But at a point of recording this video in 2021, it's unclear if Southwark are going to go ahead with this or whether they're just going to pull it down. Because over the years, after the Roan Point accident, councils have many times talked about repairing the estates and then it calms down a bit. Then it flares back up again and everyone gets all worried about how structurally safe they are. And most councils now have just had enough and are pulling in down. And now, let's start off this video by going into the first one of the tower blocks, which is Sonsfield House. In these tower blocks, there is a 24-hour fire and gas warden. Now, I thought these people were concierges, but they're not. They are just there to make sure if there's a fire, they can evacuate a block, and they are mainly there to make sure people don't bring bottles of gas into the building. So they have to have someone in all four of these buildings sitting there 24 hours just to check that people don't bring in gas bottles. That is how paranoid they are about the structural integrity of these buildings. Let's now go into Sarnsfield House and into the lift which has been modernised with international lift equipment. And now up to the motor room. The smell is so bad. It's a match being a resident having to use this water. It is so stinky. And on to the roof. Now we go to the next tower block, which is Peter Church House. In this one, the lift has been modernised with Thames Valley.
so much COVID stuff in this lift. It's like a paranoid. and up to the top floor which is abandoned. The residents have been moved out. Let's go into one of the flats and despite the fact this is England's most hated architecture, the flat's actually quite spacious. It's got big windows and it actually looks really nice. It's such a shame to think that all these residents being moved out of these blocks are most likely going to be moved to other accommodation where the flats aren't as nice to live in as this. And now up to the motor room. And on to the roof. And let's surf the lift. Now we go to the next tower block, which is Skenfrith House. And up to the motor room. Let's look at the log. View youngest event. Oh, it's all door stuff. If you're blocking doors. Has that always got? That's not much. Menu, log in now, enter calls, enter a call, enter a call. And now go to the fourth one of the tower blocks. But in this block, all of the residents have been moved out and the block is now abandoned. And there is a security guard sitting there who refused to let me in. Uh, I'll be back.
Genau, die Karte.